town has some incredible architecture uh, which uh, is only being seen by very few passing through one section of town when they're on Branch Street, if you know where that is, over by the shopping center, between the center of town and the shopping center, um, or Borough Hall, that's called Branch Street. So you're kind of going through the back of buildings. When you come through the center of town, you're coming through some beautiful architecture. Um, they're working with PennDOT to change the direction of that road to be two directions, bi-directional. There's a significant, uh, um, there's 17,000 cars a day that go through the center of town. 8,500 go one way and 8,500 go the other way. So in the end, we'll have all 17,000 going through the center of town. There's 40,000 cars a day that are on 309 that are coming to the big box stores that are rarely ever making a trip into the center of town. So we're looking at that also as um, you know, under tapped market capability. What's happening on Branch Street is we're actually converting that to angular parking. So it'll be one lane, it'll be angular parking. In the end, we have net positive parking spaces. Um, for our building, we're, we have an agreement to use the Bucks County Transit lot, um, which is on I believe that's 4th Street uh, for our property um, and there's also uh, you know there's also the same concerns from merchants about the lack of business and so we kind of argue that if we from the revitalization double your business do you care too much where people park